exciting to see how it works out, especially with the audio. I am on my way to pick up my papa because we are going swimming in the local pond. There is a sort of a pond that's close by to where we live in Ottawa. Um, it's it's not um, secret, but it's definitely not super well known about. So. I'm probably not going to talk about it all that much, just because the locals like to keep it, you know, close to their, close to their chest, and it's, it's not open all day, it's only open, you know, for the uh, morning, early morning, which is 6.30 in the morning right now, um, up until the early afternoon, and then it closes, so it's in a private area of the city as well, which makes it a little bit more uh, inaccessible, I guess, so to speak. So I'm heading there to pick up my papa, like I said. Um, he often goes swimming there in the mornings, and uh, I go occasionally when, when weather permits, but occasionally when I get up this early. So sunrise is quite nice this morning. So there's a huge protest going on downtown for uh, I guess the farmers of Ontario. So instead of driving, I decided to take the bus. It's just much easier. Uh, it's always a pain in the ass. Obviously, once you start driving, you don't want to start taking the bus again. But it's just too convenient otherwise. So. And it's air conditioned now, so I don't want to shit. Get a pretty good view of the downtown area, the Queensway here. Uh, various streets. Bank Street is the one right behind that Randall Center building. This is like our main highway. I'm in the office waiting to start my video interview uh, with the last volunteer for the network. So once this is done, there'll be no more traipsing around on the bus to get to places. So that'll be a nice break. It's kind of nice to see that view. I've never seen that before. So. Never been up this high in this location. So it's pretty late. Don't know how well you're gonna hear me over this gigantic air conditioner that I've installed in my office, but it's the only room that can handle this since I'm in the, this room most often. And it is also the only room in my apartment oh, with a door so I can actually lock the cold air in and reduce the temperature here sufficiently despite all the computers and uh, hardware that I have in here. Um, so day of blogging went okay, uh, it's been a long time since I've been at it, so uh, content is a little disjointed, but swimming scenes look kind of cool, so I'm glad that I got those, even though the audio is definitely quite muffled by that, uh, by the, the enclosure. Maybe next time I film, see if I can find something to attach the camera to my head or to my chest or to my shoulder. Um, you know, see if it works out a little bit better, but uh, definitely fun. I'm glad to be back doing this again. Um, I'm not going to try and um, 
I promise to shoot every day. It's definitely pretty challenging for me to do that. Um, but I'm gonna try and shoot as much as I can. Sometimes I'll shoot every day, but I might not post every day, depending on if the content is interesting enough. Um, I know that a lot of people have watched my blogs despite me thinking that they're incredibly boring, but I guess people kind of enjoy watching someone else's life sometimes, even if it's not that fascinating. It's just fun to see, you know, other people going through the regular, everyday things that people do. So with that, uh, I will see you all tomorrow or another day, another day this week. We've got a friend coming by uh, tomorrow and spending the, uh, the weekend with me, so might not shoot too much depending on how comfortable she is being in the, in the vlog. So, um, catch on the flip side.